last week, my average sleep score was only a 70, but one day I hit a 90 and it completely changed my life. I'm using the Muse and tracking my sleep for 90 days to figure out how to hit 90 consistently. This is week one. My average was 70. And that one day, that one 90 day, it was magical. I didn't test any variable this week. Honestly, that 90, it totally happened by accident. I'm just as surprised about it as you are. Look at the data. I went to bed after midnight, so did not go to sleep early. And I slept until 9 a.m. But the next morning, I felt like a new human being. I had clear thinking, fast thinking. I was happy without trying. Life just felt easy. All right, let's look at my sleep stages. I got two hours of REM sleep and an hour and a half of deep sleep. So Muse is great because it now has AI that you can talk to about what your data means. I'll show you more about the data as we go along. Here, look at my sleep position. I slept more on my right side than my left, and that actually surprised me. And check out my brain waves. Muse measures delta, theta, alpha, beta, and gamma. So week one taught me this. Life is better with great sleep. And it is absolutely worth figuring out how to get 90 more often. I am determined to get more 90 sleep. So come along with me as I figure the sleep stuff out. What do you do to get amazing sleep? Drop your best tip below. I'm testing out one new thing each week until my average sleep score is 80. And thanks to Muse, I will be able to understand all this amazing data and use AI to figure out how I can get way better sleep. Follow to see what habit I test in week two.